Okay, so you have a severely clogged black tank, and you don't know what to do. Um, first thing you can do is boil a pot of water, okay? Do two or three of them and throw them down here in your toilet. Just put the boiling down, do two or three of them, and let it sit for a few hours. And if that doesn't work, I have a thing called Arctic Pack. And what that does is it warms up the tanks. So I put that switch on and use that for a couple hours with the boiling water. And if that doesn't work, I have an old sewer hose right here. I have my nice rhino, but I have my old sewer hose. So I'm going to hook my old sewer hose in there, bring this end to here, and I'm going to take a little pin or a little coat hanger and push right through that sewer hose on an angle. Like, let's use this one for example. I'm going to push through right here on an angle enough to go up in there and free the toilet paper. Or whatever's clogged. Okay, what you want to do is put a slinky in or a coat hanger and you want to make a little slit inside here, like so. And what that's going to do is going to go around that bend into that black tank. Now, stuff's going to come out here, but very little. It's better than having um, a big mess. So, replacing my nice rhino with a, a junky one. I'm going to ruin this hose, by the way. It's ruined. But that's okay, it's old. Just keep working it back and forth, going straight up into the black tank, and hopefully it unclogs. Okay, what you want to do is open a flap. You could probably shut the water off while you do this, but I'm not going to because I'm a little lazy. Boiling hot water. Try to hit straight down, straight down inside. Do not touch the lip or anything. The gasket, because you might um, melt the gasket. Just go right down in there. I mean, you don't have to be too crazy about it, but try to. If you can. Guys, keep in mind, do not bring it to a complete boil. Because you could crack your tank. Because what happens is the tank, the tank's like a, a, a zigzag, like a Z. Just be careful. Just bring it just enough so you start seeing bubbles. Dump it down your tank. And you can boil two to three pots at one time. Whatever you choose to do. Just faster doing it this way. And in my case, I didn't, you know, sometimes I don't like it to bring it to a complete boil, but in my case, I didn't shut the water off on purpose. Ow, ow, ow. That, that hurts. So you guys can even use a flashlight, LED flashlight, preferable. And you can see, totally doesn't look like it's clogged at all now, does it? So, that's about all guys, it's that easy. Don't call, don't spend six, seven hundred dollars and call a pump truck to come pump your tank out from the inside. Just do it the right way and um, use the hot water. And you know what, it actually cleans your tank out really well too. And this was a completely clogged drain. I mean, it wasn't, it wasn't moving at all. Nothing, not even a drop. And we got it all straightened out. So, if this helped you guys out with your RV and took you out of a sticky situation, well, I could say the other word, but you know what I mean. Um, give me a thumbs up and give me a like and a share and you might want to subscribe to watch our crazy life here at the Depraids. See you guys. You know what to do. Like us and share us. You know you'll find us funny.